So you might be trying to figure out how you can pair up a wireless keyboard with your iPhone. So you may have some sort of wireless keyboard and you might be trying to figure out how to pair it up with your iPhone. The very first thing you're going to have to understand is that you're going to have to figure out a way to go and pair up your particular, you know, put your keyboard in pairing mode, basically. So with Magic Keyboards, you'll have to disconnect it from all the devices around you and then go ahead and basically pair it up with your iPhone. If you're using any other you know, Bluetooth keyboard, there might be a pairing button around it. So hold down that pairing button so your you know, keyboard can get into pairing mode. So once it's on and you know it seems to be fully functional for the most part, the next thing you're going to want to do is you want to make your way over to your iPhone. So make your way over to your iPhone settings once your keyboard is in pairing mode, and you want to go and get into Bluetooth. Now when you do that, you should be able to see your keyboard come up at the very bottom right here. So for me, my keyboard comes up at the very bottom right here under user's keyboard. What I can do is I can tap onto this keyboard right here and it's automatically go from, gonna go from being down here all the way to up here. So now all these buttons are going to work. So if this keyboard is working properly, you should be able to see the keyboard pop up within this particular tab up here like the battery widget. What I can do is I can make my way over here I can automatically just start typing things onto my keyboard. So let's say I wanted to search up WhatsApp. I, on my keyboard, I can just start typing in WhatsApp like this, and then it's gonna allow me to basically use my wireless keyboard with this. Now, I don't even know why my enter button wasn't working, so there it is. And I can use the keyboard keys, I think, to kind of move things around, but even if not, I can go through and just basically use my keyboard now as a wireless keyboard, which is really, really cool. So that's basically how it works. If you want to turn off your keyboard or disconnect it, you can go into here, you can turn off your keyboard just by sliding the switch if it has it, or you can go into here, click on disconnect, and it will go in wirelessly unpaired from it. So that's basically how it works. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.